Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Jesus' daughter, Lamar. Today, I want to talk to you guys about um, this sowing seed with your pastor and receiving a short-term blessing in return from your seed or receiving a long-term blessing from your seed, okay, that you sow. Now, the deal with this is that I'm talking about uh, there might be many people, many people like you that have sat in the church, at your church, and your pastor, for example, might have told you, you know how they do at church, sow a seed today and uh, of $100 or up to $1,000, and you will receive a blessing and be blessed for three months, okay? Now, the reason why I want to talk about this is because I have a problem with this. Now, my thing is, if your pastor is blessed, prosperous, Okay, and they're walking with God, and they're doing the will, they're doing their thing, but you're sowing the seed because you are waiting for a blessing from God, or you're probably trying to receive some type of miracle from God, okay, and by the pastor telling you to sow this seed, okay, they tell you, sow the seed of $500 today, and you will be blessed for four months, three months, okay, my problem is, if a person sow a seed for three to four months, uh, let's say a person sow a seed for three to four months, and they looking for a long-term uh, blessing from that seed that they sow, that's fine. But my thing is, why is it that a person sow a seed, okay, for let's say once again three hundred dollars four hundred dollars it could be a thousand dollars okay if a person saw a seed for a thousand dollars and the pastor said you will be blessed for five months whoever saw a seed of a thousand dollars in the church today in the church today will be blessed for five months you will receive miracles for five months okay my thing is why it gotta be five months why I can't be blessed for the rest of my walk, especially if it's a person that's in order with God. If you are in order with God and with your life and your walk with God and you have sowed a seed, why you can't be blessed and prosper for the rest of your walk with God on earth? Why you got to only be blessed for five months? Okay? That's not, that. I don't think it's right. I think it's, 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 it's a problem and I have a problem with that because what, the pastor can be blessed for all his time prosper right in front of his member's face but you can't be blessed and you in order with God you on, you all on point with God you doing everything God wants you to do and you're sowing this seed but then again you only get blessed for five months then what happens after the five months is up you don't see no more blessings but the pastor continuously prospering from his, his blessings from seeds that he sowed years ago I mean, man, I have a problem with that. That ain't cool. It, I mean, it's just so, it's, it's, it's hypocritical to me. Now, Pastor, if you getting blessed, I want to be blessed for the rest of my, my, my walk as well. I want to be, I want to prosper and see it all come down from, from heaven as well, from the Lord, straight up. And like I said, I have a problem with that. It's just not right, okay? Now, I understand for those that are out of order with God, they're not in order with God. That sun sees and they still not seeing these blessings um manifest in their life. Then that's 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 the, that's a different story. After the pastor have told them the lie that they're going to see a blessing, they will see a miracle after they sow they see, but they don't. Then that's a whole nother uh perspective of it. That's a whole nother uh situation. But I'm talking about somebody that's doing a part for God in order. They doing the basics. They 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 got it together. And they sow and they see, they trust in the God, and they get their blessings, and they receive the, the, the manifestation of the blessing of what the pastor said, okay? But it only stopped after five months. I mean, man, what's up with that? You want to you wanna keep on getting blessed, right? Especially if you are in order, you in order with, with the Father, with God, because, I mean, that's, that's, what, that's how it's supposed to really be, man. I mean, that ain't cool. That's not, that's to me, I call it a counterfeit miracle because 
it's like that's how Satan rolls. Satan will bless you for a short term when you live for him and you sowing seeds for Satan's kingdom. And then after that, you that's it. Your blessings get cut off. No, nah, man, that's not that's not that's not cool. God wants his children that's following him and doing everything right by him to be blessed for the rest of their days, man. That's like God saying he wants you to be blessed for a couple of months, like your pastor said. Pastor Sheila said to you, the members, you will be blessed for five months since you sold this thousand dollar seed. But after that, your blessing stopped. Nah, man, that's not God, man. It can't be. That, that, that's just not him. Because God wants you to be blessed for the rest of your days, man. Your seed's supposed to keep going for the rest of your days and cover all and cover the rest of your days. And you manifest. It manifests in that person's life, I'm sorry, that they will see their blessing and everything manifests and they walk. You see what I'm saying? While they're here on earth. And like I said, man, you got pastors that's doing that, man. Y'all sending these churches and these pastors telling y'all this. You're going to receive a blessing for three months for sowing a hundred to a $1,000 worth of seed. Man, I'm telling you, man. If you are seeing, if you are seeing no blessing, no miracle, or if you send a miracle in those three months, like your pastor said, but it stops after that, and you got to keep sowing more money to see more miracles, I mean, man, I'm being honest. If you ain't walking with God and you don't have no purpose of walking with God or no intentions, then, yeah, that's normal for a person like you because you're not walking with God. You don't want God. But if you is walking with God and you're doing everything right by God, man, your blessings, you're supposed to be blessed throughout your whole walk, man, straight up. And people like, you know, today, y'all have to get out of this false uh, lie and stop living a lie with this stuff. It's just not right. You know what I'm saying? And y'all want to see and believe this and accept this from these pastors and keep seeing your pastor prosper or whoever it is around you that's prospering, that's saying that they, you know, want you to sow these seeds, but... But you're not seeing nothing, in, you know, you, they, they speaking over your life to only receive three to five months of blessings. And after that, your blessing, the miracle stop. I have a problem with that, like I said again, because why is it that the pastors can prosper forever and, and be blessed throughout their whole walk and half of them don't even be having God? They don't even be following the, the real God, the black Jesus. They don't even follow this man and do nothing right by him half the time, but they, they prosper Okay, they're getting over on, on the church and they people. And like I said, man, that ain't that's like a counterfeit miracle to me, man, because that's how Satan roll. And I just want to make this clear to y'all. Satan roll like that. He blesses people. Lucifer give his kids the blessings. The ones that he got picked out and look at like that to load them down with all these blessings. Then after that, he he deceived them and lied to them and he cut the blessings off. Ain't that how Satan roll? That sound like how, that's how certain certain pastors roll that ain't ain't really from, from the Lord. Straight up. That's how they roll. And y'all better open your eyes and stop being stupid because that's not cool, man. If you can uh, prosper all your days, I mean, if I'm doing right by going, I'm doing my power. I want to prosper and be blessed throughout, throughout my day. That's how y'all supposed to look at this for the ones that are walking with God and doing your part by God, man. Straight up. It's nothing else. You, it's nothing else around that, man. And if y'all want to paint these pictures about about this situation, y'all can keep painting pictures, but I ain't painting no picture. I'm walking in the light with this stuff because it's just the real truth, man, straight up. It's the real truth. And that's all I want to say, man. I just hope y'all take this uh, message, you know, uh, you know, and to, the, to, the, to another level and, and walk in this because it's true, man. I mean, you're supposed to be blessed just like the, your past. You're supposed to be, especially if you're doing everything right by God. And you probably love God and really take God more serious than your pastor. I mean, come on, man. That stuff don't look right. But I just wanted to share this message with you guys today. And uh, like I said, man, three to five months, miracles, blessings, and after that cuts off, I got a problem with that. You know what I'm saying? Why the pastor keep on shining and getting all his blessings and, and miracles? Nah, man. Yeah, that stuff, man, that stuff is a, is, 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 is a joke. It's, it's not right. Straight up. It's not right. And I just, that's just, I'm going to leave it at that.